Let's balance the equation for B2O3 plus C plus Cl2. We have diboron trioxide, sometimes just called boron trioxide, carbon, and then chlorine gas. So we'll start by counting the atoms up on each side of the equation. Two boron atoms, oxygen's three, just the one carbon, and then two chlorine atoms. Product side, we have one boron, one oxygen, one carbon, and then three chlorine atoms. Let's just balance the boron first. If we put a coefficient of two here, one times two, that'll give us two of those. And then the two, it goes to everything. So we have the three times the two. That'll give us six chlorine atoms. That's not too bad because we could put a three here, two times three, that's six. We still need to balance the oxygen atoms that won't really be a problem though. We put a three here. We have the one oxygen times three. So those are balanced. And then we have the one carbon times three. That gives us three carbons, but carbon, it's all by itself. Just put a three here, one times three, and that gives us three. We're done. This equation is balanced. If you wanted to write the states, they look like this. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for B2O3 plus C plus Cl2. Thanks for watching.